Welcome back to another wonderful day in the wonderful world of Prodigy. In today's video, I'm getting myself the Shiver Chill Gem. So without a further ado, let's get into the video and this is your host, One Doctor Genius. Okay, so now we have to go to the throne room and pick up the gem because Bach is lazy. Well, what to go to Fort Well, you can only light that after you complete all of the quests. Let's just share our achievements and open the Conjure Cube. Let's see what we will get. Okay, let's see. And we've gotten ourselves the Jester's Robe. Just amazing. No, I do not want to wear the Jester's Robe. Right now, what I want to do is I want to get myself the gem. So that means we're gonna have to defeat this ice sneak, obviously. So let's me just quickly battle this ice sneak. Hiya, mode activated. Alakazam. You know what? That's even better. Okay. Yeah, I know. I made a video on this. Okay guys, I'm just gonna play this quickly and then answer two questions. After waiting nearly an year, the video is finally complete and now we have to answer multiplication questions. So that's obvious, now let's answer the next question and do 25,000 damage. Da, 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 da. I just answered my question correctly and here we shall be doing about approximately 790... What? Did I just say 700... That thing died before you could even finish your spell. Yeah. Oh my gosh, did I just do 179,000 damage? Holy guacamole, that's... That's insane, I mean like, whoa. Wow. Okay, so will both of our Funkeels please level up and evolve, because I kind of need them to level up. And another thing is I'm super close to getting myself, um, enough, um... Guys, another thing is, except for my Funkeels evolving, I'm also pretty close to getting myself enough, um, sand dollars to buy all of the stuff from all of the Dragonox gear. And yes, it has been one day, and in one day I got myself 150 sand dollars, okay? Well, that was a fairly easy question to solve, so that's gonna be some easy 2,015 damage. Yay! I mean, like, I did pronounce that wrong, it's 2,715 damage. And, oh my gosh! Wait, did that just happen? Did we do, like, a normal number of damage in Prodigy? Just 2,000 with two clean zeros? Nothing else? I thought that was completely illegal and rare. Do you guys remember the old spells of Prodigy, which were Zero, Pummel, and that stuff? I miss those spells, they were so cool. Zero was the best spell in Prodigy. Even before Supernova. Zero was the best spell in Prodigy. Just only level 100, oh wait, no, only level 75 wizards had access to cast the spell Zero. And um, back in old Prodigy, it would do a fair amount of damage. So let's just quickly destroy this cloaker before he destroys us. Because... No! I'm not gonna answer two questions to kill this guy with one spell. So let me just skip that. Why would I need to do a focus spell to answer this question? I'm not in right? I just saw the previous question. Okay, here we go. 2,743 damage. Done. So it looks like our monster will be defeated. And... Are you guys hearing that voice? What is it? No, it used to be like an odd number. It always used to be an odd number whenever I cast the spell. Guys, for some reason in every battle I keep on getting a sand dollar. And in addition, if we just slow down what was in the beginning, what you guys can see is that the crystal was sitting right there next to the tree. And then it disappeared. Well, whatever. Let's just head up into the throne room and let's enter inside. Dun, 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 dun. And of course, I have to battle the Bataram. Of course, battling the Bataram, the best thing to do every day. Yay! Let's 
Okay, so it looks like our funky is super close to leveling up. And now that this monster battle's done, there's just gonna be a montage, like a quick, like, a few seconds montage of me just battling monsters and reaching the throne room. Ooh, looks like we got ourselves a wand. Okay, it's a training wand. That's no, I do not want to wear this. This does, like, five damage. Okay, so let's just slide across, share our achievements, head up all the way over here. Yeah. No! You Are you kidding me? You didn't need to back to that. Both of my funky leveled up. Okay, so they're evolving now. Okay, let's let this one evolve all the way and I'll stop the other one from like one step. Okay. Keep on evolving into a phantom. Oh yeah, I'm a phantom. Yay! However, uh next funky will also be attempting to evolve. So let's just let it evolve. It will evolve into a Benin. Okay. A Benin. A Benin. Okay. So what if? After doing one additional unnecessary battle, I can finally head up and follow the path. Got enough of every melody, they all sound the same. Yeah. For my broken heart, no remedy. But maybe if you stay, we can get away with it. Cause you make me love. And now, after a short monster murdering spree, we end up over here. So let's just head inside of the room, and here we end up in the throne room. So now, obviously, there's the gem. Let's just click on it. And head back, okay? <laughs> Bob knew you could do it. Yes, you he did. Oh, yay, we got ourselves the pickaxe, dude. That's all Mr. Bob just gives us the axe. That's literally all he what does. What about your furnaces? Why aren't they lit? Oh, yeah, now time to light the fort furnace. Okay guys, so that's all for today's video, I hope y'all enjoyed it, and in today's video I just got myself the Shiver Chill Gem and I battled the Ice Worm, so yay! And guys, that's all for this video, I hope y'all enjoyed it, and if you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and leave a big like, and I'll catch y'all next time, One Doctor Genius out, and subscribe if you haven't already, and yeah, bye!